National Doctor Day is March 30th, and Doctor of Osteopathic Medicine Sarah Schaller explains a day in her life at Sydney Regional Medical Center. Bouncing around between the clinic and the hospital and delivering babies and taking care of the pediatrics in the hospital. Schaller says there are parts of her job most people do not realize she has to do every day. There's a bunch of behind the scenes stuff that we right. have to do versus just seeing you in the, the, in the clinic. It definitely doesn't end there. There's notes to do. There's, you know, prescriptions to refill. There's these silly insurance companies that don't like the things we send them. Schaller says even when she clocks out, she is still thinking about her patients. This is not like a true nine to five job. When I leave here, it's still in my head. I'm still getting phone calls or doing refills and things at home. And we're still thinking about that one patient that I'm not 100% sure what's going on or, you know, doing my own independent research at home to see if there's any new treatments or new things coming out that I can provide my patients with. The hardest part of the job to Schaller is still thinking about her patients outside of work. The other thing is if you are a sicker patient, you know, we're constantly thinking about you 24-7, so our visit doesn't end as soon as you walk out the door. Schaller is constantly having to do research to stay ahead in her field. You have to be a lifelong learner. You have to stay up to date on evidence and constantly reading and so you'll get behind really quickly on the the new things in medicine if you you don't read and stay up to date. Schaller's favorite part of the job is delivering babies. She says it's one of the only times people come to a hospital for a happy reason. Anytime you get to bring a new life into the world that's just a different side of medicine so that's 100% why I decided to do that extra training in OB. Schaller says SRMC can have from one to ten babies born there a month. Just the joy of seeing that family the mom and dad throughout the entirety of pregnancy or even that couple who've tried for forever to get pregnant and then finally it happens and you get to hand them that baby. That's one of the best feelings in the world. Schaller says delivering babies makes all the difficult parts of her job worth it. You know, I could be there for two days straight and super tired and have a 2 a.m. delivery. Just that rush you get after that, like it's, it's definitely confirms every single time why I continue to do it. For News Channel Nebraska, I'm Sarah McCoy.